All right, YouTube, so for the first half of this vlog, I will be talking about productivity and chores. And the big four are cooking, cleaning, shopping, and laundry, at least the big four that I'll be talking about in this video. So to start off with cooking, cooking I have mixed feelings about because sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't, but to elaborate further, I enjoy preparing the ingredients and making like cold foods like um, playa bowls or like yogurt with granola in it or like poke bowls, although I have yet to do that, but that's a brilliant idea. But honestly, cooking, like literally cooking, like with the stove and the heat, I'm not the biggest fan of. I like making scrambled eggs, but I have a long way to go before I become an at-home chef. But yeah, I definitely like prep cooking at home, at least to say. Now the next one, cleaning, is by far my least favorite of these four. However, if I do have to say one good thing about cleaning, it's that it is very satisfying once it's done. You know, it's easy, there's an old saying, it's easier to go down a hill than up it, but the view is better at the top. So the same applies to cleaning. You know, maybe cleaning isn't so bad after all. Actually, no, it kind of sucks still. And yes, I scripted that line. I usually go off script a lot, but I don't know. That was my attempt at a funny joke and I probably did a bad job. So number three is shopping. So as you guys know, I don't drink or smoke, but I can certainly shop and I definitely got to be careful not to overindulge, but Shopping when done occasionally can be a super fun activity like no other. And that goes for grocery shopping or even just recreational shopping or whatever the shopping case may be. Now number four, laundry, I am sort of 50-50 on because I don't mind like, you know, the general process, the start, the middle, but it's the end that kills me. It's the putting away the laundry that's the tedious task, but it does strengthen my discipline at the end of the day, so I gotta give that two thumbs up in the end. So this is the eve of 914 day, which is a big holiday among my family, especially among Luke, because that's his special day, 914. But um, yeah, for me, in one week, it will be fall officially, and one day closer to Inktober and Sober October. But to be honest, Inktober and Sober October are activities I do the whole year, so it makes no difference to me, honestly. And yeah, this was today's vlog, the 914 Eve special. Did I do a good job? Hopefully. Thank you all for watching. Stay tuned for more soon. Goodbye.